This week we're going to talk about some more notes that can be used in records for video recordings. And we're going to start off by talking about audience notes. And these are just what they sound like. They're used to convey information about the intended audience of an item. One thing to note about this is that audience notes should only be included if the information appears somewhere on the item. It's not up to catalogers judgment to supply audience notes. One very common use of audience notes for video recordings are ratings from the Motion Picture Association of America. So movies that are rated things like R or PG or PG-13, things like that, you can include that information in an audience note. So in this case, you would do something like this, MPAA rating R. For things like children's videos, you might also see an age group suggested, for example. This one tells us that this video is for ages 5 through 9. And so that is also information that can be included in an audience note. In a marked record, an audience note goes into 521 field. And unlike some other notes, the first indicator is not undefined. There are values for the first indicator. If you leave it, and the first indicator is used to create a display constant telling the user what type of information is displayed in that field. If you leave the first indicator blank, the display constant audience will come up. But if you want a more specific display constant, you can use any of these values for the first indicator. So for example, here are our examples from before. In the first example, both indicators are blank, which means that if your catalog can generate display constant, audience will show up before this MPAA rating in your record. In the second example, the first indicator is 1, which indicates age interest level. And that's what we have here in ages 5 through 9. The second indicator is undefined, and the text of the note goes in subfield A. 